Welcome to the Holson Valley Unitarian Universalist Virtual Church. My name is Tom Burns, and I hope you're doing well. Today, our minister, the Reverend Jeff Breer, was at a loss for words, so he asked the Religious Services Committee for advice. A friend of mine mentioned in a Facebook post that because everyone is staying home, it's much quieter now, and she noticed the birds singing. To accompany the lighting of the chalice, I have some words from Terry Tempest Williams about the birds. I pray to the birds. I pray to the birds because I believe they will carry the messages of my heart upward. I pray to them because I believe in their existence, the way their songs begin and end each day, the invocations and benedictions of earth. I pray to the birds because they remind me of what I love rather than what I fear. And at the end of my prayers, they teach me how to listen. For music today, Karis Carter brings us a tune inspired by Puccini's opera, Tosca. Charlie Chaplin composed this tune and used it as a theme in his 1936 film, Modern Times. The lyrics were written by John Turner and Jeffrey Parsons in 1954. This is Smile. I hope everyone is doing well today. Smile, though your heart is aching. Smile, even though it's breaking. When there are clouds in the sky, you'll get by. If you smile, We'll sing Loving Kindness next. Please light a candle to dispel the darkness or to honor someone or some event or to bring light to a memory.
My name is Jeff Breer, and I am the virtual minister of this virtual church. I hope you're doing well. The Religious Services Committee thought that as much as possible during this pandemic, we should stick to the schedule that we put together for this spring. So this week, looking at the ca calendar, I see that I'm supposed to talk about humanism, but I'm not really enthused about an exploration of humanism at this time. I'll return to that topic at a later time. So I know what I don't want to talk about, but I was struggling to find an appropriate topic. So I asked the Religious Services Committee what I should talk about, and this is what they told me, as near as I can remember. Number one, look for the helpers. Those people who are doing the right thing at this time, those who are not cowed, or if they are, they don't show it. So I see the driver for the pharmacy who delivers prescription medications to my house. I see all the people who wave at me when I take Bella for a walk. I suppose helpers could also be things like the dogwoods in bloom that I see now and the birds that I hear. I see the newspaper still arrives on my front porch every morning. Helpers can also be corporations. I see Panera Bread, which has stopped selling sandwiches and started selling groceries. I see Verizon, which gave all of its customers a ton of data for a couple of months. And another helper is humor. I ran across a post on Facebook that referenced a version of Do Re Mi, the coronavirus version. A woman in New Zealand, who sounds an awful lot like Julie Andrews, rewrote the lyrics for this pandemic and layered that track over the original footage from the movie The Sound of Music. It was very clever, and I was entertained for the full six minutes. She also did the same thing for My Favorite Things and Mr. Sandman. She called it Wash Your Hands, Man. Then I discovered that other people had written parodies of other well-known songs with lyrics specific to this time of isolation. A British family of six did a hilarious send-up of One Day More from La Mis. And this is what happens when you take creative people and make them stay at home. They create some very funny things. You can find many fun videos created lately if you go to YouTube and look around. Number two, the committee told me, admit your fear. That's not hard for me to do. Sometimes I'm scared and then sometimes I don't want to think about it. I have strong memories of stage fright and that feeling centers in a pit in my stomach. I have felt it more than once this past month and just admitting that I'm frightened helps ease the feeling. Number three, who said you must improve? Well, no one. That's right. No one is demanding that I be any more than I can be right now. I am in charge of me. I want to improve, but right now it's not required. And number four, begin with a song. Only in this case, it's more like the end of what I have to say. This song was written by a woman who was battling breast cancer. Ronnie Arbo won her battle, but not before she had some existential discussions with herself about living and dying. Jeff wrote a new tag for the ending, and he sent it to Ronnie. And she replied, rock on, Jeff. And this is big old life. Glass half empty, glass half full. Depends on the day, depends on the fool who is asking. And the fool who replies, you're going to drink it up. Anyway, doesn't really matter what you say. Raise your cup to another day in this big old life. Door wide open, door closed down. Depends on the moon, depends on the clown in your head. Who waving all of those signs? 
couldn't wheeze Go straight for that exit, please Step onto the path you've made In this big old life Sun comes up, sun goes down On every small forgotten town Shining on every soul Spilling light in every dark hole There ain't a thing you gotta do To let that sun shine down on you But step right in to this big old life Love me tender, love me not Depends on the flower, depends on the heart plucking petals and the mirror inside. Are you ready to rise and shine? Are you ready to say, be mine? If you are, then let's take a ride in this big old life. Are you ready to rock and roll? Are you ready to lose control? If you are, put your heart and soul in this big old life. I want to close with the words of Stephen Schick. Spirit of life and love, we have learned to trust the rhythm of changing seasons. We delight in the certainty that each change, no matter how wrenching, brings with it the promise of new life. Yet in the affairs of our own days, there are times when we lose our trust and the rhythms of change. In those moments, we pray to be reminded of how dawn follows night and spring arrives only after winter has lost its grip. Here, in the uncertainty of the moment, help us accept change with the delight of a child coming of age or of an elder embracing newfound wisdom. When we long for the comforts of what can no longer be, lift, a he lift our heads above our losses and our fears and cast our eyes on the promises of new beginnings. The expression, we're all in this together, has been invoked quite a lot these days. Our benediction today comes from Mitch Finley, and he has a different take on the expression. The Christian doctrine of the communion of saints is simple, really. All it says is that once you buy the farm, you still live on the farm. All it says is that those who have gone before us are still with us. All it says is that past generations still count and must be taken into account. In other words, we're all in this together, all of us. Please help me close this service now. We extinguish this flame, but not the light of truth, the warmth of community, or the fire of commitment. These we carry in our hearts and share with all the world. My name is Lenore Huss, and I'm happy that we could be together today. Thanks for joining us, and please come back whenever you like. We will post another virtual church service next Sunday. Our Facebook page has more good content. On Mondays, it features something for youngsters, on Wednesdays, inspirational content, and on Fridays, you can find all ages content there. Many thanks to Anne and Cindy for putting this together. To close today's service, Karis Carter offers us good advice in a song originally written in 1899 by Ada Blankhorn and J. Howard Edweil. The song was popularized in a 1928 recording by the Carter family, Keep on the Sunny Side. As you make your way through the next week, remember these words. You are good. You are loved. We all need a little work, and we're all in this together. Nothing left to say, but yay, virtual church! There's a dark and a troubled side of life. But there's a bright and a sunny side too Though you meet with the darkness and strife 
the sunny side you also may view. Keep on the sunny side, always on the sunny side. Keep on the sunny side of life. It will help us every day. It will brighten all the way if we keep on the sunny side of life. Though the storm bits a fury rage today. Crushing hope that we cherish so dear. The cloud and storm will time and pass. And the sun again will shine bright and clear. That's right. Keep on the sunny side. Always on the sunny side. Keep on the sunny side of life. It will help us every day. It will brighten all the way if we keep the sunny side of life. Let us greet with a song of hope each day. Though the moment be cloudy or fair, and let us trust in our Savior. He'll keep us everyone in his care. Keep on the sunny side, always on the sunny side. Keep on the sunny side of life. It'll help us every day. It will brighten all the way if we keep on the sunny side of life. One more time. Keep on the sunny side, always on the sunny side. Keep on the sunny side of life.